bringing you guys another open supply drop today we're going to be doing 50 of them that's right guys you heard it 50 we went bigger and better this time i know we've done 10 we've done 20 we've done 30 we've even done 40 i told you guys it was going to get bigger and better every single time and now it is we're doing an open supply drop 50 crypto keys well 500 crypto keys that's 50 open supply drops but you know that we're going to open some rares and without further ado guys let's go ahead and jump into it For our first, we got the Peak Classic Reflex Reticle. Then we have two Royal Camos, one for the Pharaoh and another one for the KN44. And you guys know that you guys know that I love it very much. I'm actually hoping that we kind of get maybe some new uh, uh, camos, new outfits for our characters. And definitely some new skins for the shotguns because I definitely got some new videos coming up for you guys for that. So that is going to be truly amazing. Let's see what else we get. Whoa, okay guys, now we have the Inferno M8A7 camo, which looks truly amazing on the M8, and that's not a weapon that I really use, but I probably will start doing that, definitely if I want to get uh, get that diamond. Uh, then we have the Firebrain VMP camo, I think I've only had this camo for one weapon, but I'm definitely liking it a lot, it looks truly amazing. You got it's legendary, so that's you know amazing within itself. Then we have the drop shot for the reflex reticle, which looks really cool. You definitely might see me use that, most definitely. Mm. And I tell you guys, it was definitely a grind getting uh, 50, uh, 500 crypto keys, I tell you that. And lo and behold, we just said that we will want something more for the shotguns, and we got it, guys. There you go. We have an epic ice camo for the 205 breche camo i believe that's how you say it this gun is truly amazing at times depending on the map and how you set it up but i definitely like it a lot you guys know i'm about to step out and show you guys what it looks like so let's definitely take a look at that real quick there you guys go right there that is the new ice camo that is an epic it looks truly amazing let's put that on there actually i mean look at that guys that is really cool really really cool wow that is amazing i'm definitely excited about that all right guys let's jump back into it okay guys now we have the thief decal i really don't mess with the decals too much i've got you know so many of them I really don't do that uh it's not really you know my thing um now we have the oscar green reflex radical i'm definitely gonna put that uh, all my reflex because I like the way that that looks. It's really, really cool. Then we have the Hallucination MAA7 camo. And I have so many of those. You guys know that. You see me do my open supply drops. I have so many of these camos. It is ridiculous. But it's good to have it for every weapon. I think that looks kind of cool. So I'm definitely excited about that. Uh, now you guys know what is about to happen. We're about to do the rare supply drop open. Hopefully we get our fingers crossed here. We get something good and let's do it guys. I mean, shoot, I think my toes are even crossed right now. Let's see what we get. Whoa. Okay guys, and you can see I got a crypto key bonus right there, which is really cool. I believe you get that every time you open a supply drop. I'm not sure, but I believe that's what that is. Um, now we have the Phoenix BMP Fast Mag variant, which looks really, really cool. Then we have the Contrast Paint Shop Emblem Material. And then we have the Hulshin, Hulkin, I don't really know how to say that. Uh, MA7 camo. I've got that for a lot of things already. I've got it for the knife. I've got it for my Cuda. Uh, and various other weapons. I, don't, I can't remember off that. But I really do like that camo a lot. It looks really, really cool. Um, I'm glad they put that in the game. Let's do one more rare supply drop open and see what we get this time guys Hopefully we get something really really nice. We already got one of the uh, Shotgun camos. All right guys here. We have the rumble calling card, which is a common and then we have the war fire break post gesture Which we already have that so nothing nothing too crazy here back to the regular supply drops Okay, now we have another camo for the 205. I don't know why they're giving me all the camo just for the 205, but now we have the dust camo, which looks really cool. You guys have seen that a lot. 
Um, then we have the Precision Recon Reticle. That looks really, really nice. I like that a lot also. Nothing too crazy yet, guys. Nothing, you know, really, really exciting. But we're getting there. I can feel it. I know big things are coming. Whoa. Speaking of that. Okay, guys. Now we have the Dust Camo for the ICR, which I believe we already have one of these. I'm not really sure. Then we have the Jungle Party for the L Car 9 camo, which is a rare, and that looks really amazing. I'm actually gonna back out, show you guys what that looks like. This is my first time seeing it myself. Then we have the power uh, sight for the re the Varix 3 radical. All right, guys, let's see what this looks like. Uh oh, we don't have the L Car 9. I am so sorry, guys. Oh, I am so sorry. We do not have the L Car 9. Whoopsie! Nigel Fury, big move. I forgot I don't use pistols. Sorry about that, guys. Alright, nothing too crazy here. We have the hallucination for the PO6, the dust for the black cell, and then the crossbone detail. Whoa! Alright, guys, now we have the ice camo for the PO6. That could have came at a better time. And that's an epic, obviously, as you just seen for the 205 shotgun. So that looks really, really nice. Again, uh, they did a tremendous job with that camo. Not too much, not too little. It looks just right. So I'm really excited to have that on my weapon. I can't wait to run around with it. Now we have the Jungle Cat paint shop emblem material. It's my first time seeing this also. Whoa, all right, now we have the Dead Eye Shiva Fast Mags variant. That looks really amazing. I really like that a lot. You unlock that for that weapon at level 14. Now, as I've said this before in numerous of my open supply drop videos, and I will it, ah, I will say it over and over and over again. The variants for these weapons do not uh make your weapon better it only makes it look better that is it that's the only thing that it does so please remember that guys i don't want you guys to put this on your weapon and then you guys go oh my god why isn't it better you know what, what's going on the variants only make your weapon look cooler that is it it does not improve your stats or anything of that nature all right now we have the cash money spectra uh boast gesture which is a rare that looks really amazing and really cool about that so Let's move on to the next one. Now we have the cross purple reflex reticle, which is a hallucination uh, for the locust camo. And then we have the wings decal. So that looks nice. All right, guys, nothing too crazy here. We got another uh, crypto key bonus. Nothing too crazy here. We have the guns for the Seraph Bows Gesture, which I believe we already have unlocked that before. Now we have the Triforce Reflex Reticle, which is really nice. I really, really love the way that that looks. And then we have the Stealth for the KN44 Camo. I think I'm actually going to put that on that gun. Um, I feel kind of stealthy when I run around with it because when it shoots, it's not that loud. It's kind of silent. Um, so I, I definitely think that that would fit that gun a lot. It would definitely fit how I play on certain boards with that weapon. So I really think you guys would enjoy that. As you know, we got to do another, uh, rare supply drop open this. Hopefully we get something good here, guys. Oh, oh, whoa. All right, guys, this is truly amazing right here. Hands down. This is the best rare supply drop i've ever opened right now now we have the all gun battery threatened gesture which is rare then we have the psychedelic spectra body thing camo which is legendary and then we have the ultimate camo that everybody looks for which is the storm camo and now we have it for the combat knife guys that is truly amazing i'm really really liking it right now I couldn't ask for a better rare open supply drop. I know sometimes people say that uh, the common supply drops are better, which I'm not saying that they're wrong, but this time in a battle that is common supply drop versus open uh, rare supply drop, the rare supply drop definitely won. So I really like that. I hope you guys liked it. 
we're definitely going to take a look and see what this camo looks like uh, for both of these characters here. Oh, the combat knife is locked. Dog on it. I am so sorry, guys. My God, I am so sorry. And my specter is locked, too. All right. All right, guys, back at it here. That was a truly amazing rare supply drop. I can't get over that. I really can't. All right, now we have the Verdi for the Vesper camo. And you guys, please correct me if I'm saying that wrong because I really don't know if I'm saying that wrong or not. Um, then we have the uh, the Hawken camo that I told you that I liked before. I tell you, that rare supply drop really got me hyped. That was an awesome supply drop. That is the first um, piece of... Uh, equipment that i got for the inspector so that was really cool now we have the sharpshooter locust fmj variant that looks really amazing uh for that weapon i'm definitely going to show you guys what that looks like right now i know for, for a fact that i do have that unlocked at least um oh, i'm going into all the wrong categories sorry <laughs> yep locust right here for you guys all right Oh, but I don't have the FMJ unlocked. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry, guys. Lord have mercy. I know you guys are like, Nigel, you are such a big noob. I know. I know. All right, guys. There we go. The Stealth for the HVK-30. Then we have the Verde for the Weevil. And then a Hallucination for the LCAR-9. Nothing too crazy there. Once again, nothing too crazy. We got the highway uh, sight, and then we have the Oscar Amber, which we've already had that before. Uh, nothing too crazy. All right, now we have the heat camo for the PO6, which is the first time getting it for that weapon. Um, I believe I do have it for another weapon. I'm not quite sure. I believe that I do. Um... Now, keep on grinding here, guys. I know we have some bigger supply drop opens coming. I know we got some good things coming, guys. I really like that brains decal. There's a little zombies little theme going on there. I like that a lot. That's really cool. All right, guys. Now, this is what I'm talking about. We have the Royal Camo for the Combat Knife. That looks really amazing. I really like that a lot. They really did uh, something nice with that right there. Then we have the Hallucination XR2 Camo. Then we have the Headshot Nomad Threatened Gesture, which is a rare. So that's really cool. You know the rare supply drop open is coming right after this one, but hopefully this one can knock it out of the park. Can we save it? Okay, we have the Steel Rain for the Dingo Extended Mag variant. That looks really nice. I really like that a lot. Um, as you guys know, I'm not a big fan of the L LMGs. I wasn't a big fan of it in uh, uh, Advanced Warfare, but I definitely was in Ghost and in Black Ops 2, depending on the map. Now, here we have the Fusion uh, Amber Thermal Reticle. That looks really nice. Uh, I guess that's, you know, going uh, all scientific on this here, which actually fits this Call of Duty um, in whole. Uh, it looks really nice. It really fits the theme of this new Call of Duty. So I like what they did there. That looks awesome. Now, back to the rare supply drop, guys. Let's go. So far, it has not let us down. Let's see what we get here. All right, guys, we got the transgression for the MR6 camo, which I really love this camo a lot. I don't know how many of you have it. Have it. I'm sorry I said have it. Uh, I don't know how many of you guys have that camo. Definitely comment down below on this video and let me know, you know, if you guys have the transgression, what you guys think of it. But I really like it a lot. It's, it's not too much. It's not too little. It's just right. Uh, the design is really perfect. It has that kind of like dark feel to it. Makes you feel kind of uh, robotic in a way. It looks really, really nice. I like it a lot. Then we have the Ha Ha for the Ruined Bow Stretcher, which is rare. A lot of people have that. I like it. It's a tremendous. All right, guys. Now we're moving on to the second one, guys. Let's see what we get here. All right, guys. Now we have the Night 
uh, face piece for Sarah, which is really cool because I have that for... Yo, what is up, guys? I had to pop in really quick just to let you know that the uh, memory actually messed up for this recording, so I definitely apologize about that. I'm going to cue in some music for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Got a lot of epic supply drop open still to come, so I hope you guys enjoy them. It is your boy, Nigel Fury. I will see you guys soon. I love you guys. Come check out my live stream tonight on Twitch.tv by the time this video is up. My Twitch channel will be live. So I love you guys. See you guys soon. And I'm out of here. Oh, <laughs> 